all staying healthy and safe thank you all so very much for supporting my channel if you haven't already subscribed please consider subscribing to my channel and also if this video helps you please consider giving it a thumbs up I've discussed about text before and text after in my previous videos uh, today I'll be discussing about text split which is a very helpful function the first column here has addresses listed and I'd like to utilize text split function to separate uh, these texts into street, city, state, and zip code. In order to do so, what I'll do is I'll type in equals and then I'll type in text split, open braces. The first part of this formula is text. So I'll select the text here, which is A2. And then I'll put in comma. The second part is column delimiter. which is comma over here and I'll close this and close braces I'll hit enter now uh, you notice that our um, address is separate into street city state and zip code if you notice um, here uh, C2 D2 and E2 there are spaces or there is space in front of B C and A here so what the text split function did was uh, it uh, separated the text right after a comma which included the space that is why we have space here so what we can do here is if we put in space um, for the column delimited part and hit enter the spaces in front of these gets removed uh, the other option here is uh, what we can do is we can use trim function uh, to remove those spaces as well so if you notice that uh, after I use trim function the spaces are gone as well uh, for now uh, I'll just keep it um, as this um, now what I'll do is I will drag this uh, all the way to row 7 um, from row 2 through 6 we have correct separations uh, of street city state and zip code however the last one uh, doesn't have correct separation because if you notice it has um, delimiters that are other than comma so basically what it did was uh, text split only selected this as a delimiter that's why the separation happened right after comma so in order to remove this error uh, what we can do is we can add additional delimiters within curly braces into in our formula so I will put in additional delimiters here um, and I'll hit enter if I drag this all the way to the bottom now you can see that um, the separation is now correct and again to remove the spaces we can either put in space um, after our delimiters or utilize trim function Now we have correct separations of all our rows. The other cool um, stuff about uh, text split function is uh, we can utilize, uh, for example, if we have um, um, some salaries listed. Um, let's see Ariel has uh, 3,000 salary uh, Barry has 4,000 uh, Carrie has 5,000 and then let's see uh, Derek has 6,000 now what I like to do is um, separate these um, in like a table format um, 
So what I'll do is I will utilize this text split function. Text split uh, function and use both column delimiter and row delimiter, which is optional, which was optional. Um, so now, um, in this case, our column delimiter would be uh, equals here. And then our row delimiter is comma. So I'll put in comma here. And then I'll hit enter. Now, you notice that um, this, this text is uh, separated into like a table format. Um, the removal of um, spaces can be done by putting in space here or utilizing prim function again. Um, so this is how uh, you can use text split into uh, text split function in another way as well. So um, hope this video helps you all. If this video helps you, uh, please consider giving it a thumbs up and um, also please support this channel by subscribing to this channel. Thank you all so very much. Y'all have a good day. Bye-bye.